I am Dr. Vaikun Raju, child neurologist working at Indira Gandhi Institute of Child Health and also I practices at Vijayanagar Bangalore Child Neurology and Rehabilitation Center. Minilateral hemiplegia in children uh, are uh, due to many reasons. Some other reasons are it may be related to birth related problem, birth related injury to the brain or at the time of birth or immediately after birth if a baby developed any sudden onset of weakness on one side because of many reasons like uh, clot in the arteries it can be due to infection in the brain or it may be due to bleeding in the brain or due to trauma during the birth uh, passage time. So because of this problem child can develop uh, the one side hemiplegia in the newborn period. Later age group there are many reasons compared to adult people. The causes are various uh, reasons. One may be related to heart problem. If anything the clot is there in the heart, it can discharge the brain and cause uh, weakness on one side. Other causes may be related to blood related problems like lack of blood uh, hemoglobin or uh, blood cancers can also cause uh, this problem. Other causes may be related to brain related uh, infections like uh, maybe a closest of brain or other infection in the brain or viral infection in the brain or brain fever or it may be related to the fall also. So this uh, if any child comes with one side weakness initially you need to assess the child for emergency management. So they need to find out whether it is uh, weakness is because of uh, thrombosis or embolism or it is due to because of bleeding. So management differs in each case. So if it is due to bleeding, you need to find out the reason for bleed and you need to treat the bleed appropriately. If it is due to thrombosis or clot, then you need to give medicine to dissolve the clot. Initially two medicines are there to dissolve the clot and most of the times they will come into neurologist later uh, in the part of the events. So that time you need to manage uh, hemiplegia appropriately in the form of proper physiotherapy. If stiffness is too much, you need to give sometimes medicines also. Or mainly physiotherapy, spasticity management, uh, sometimes we require the injection bottle and toxin also. And uh, regarding managing the generalized seizures, usually generalized seizures commonly seen in other types of uh, hemiplegia, usually quadriplegia, but hemiplegic uh, also they can have conversion. So there are various uh, ways of treating uh, generalized seizures uh, in children. So, if only one, uh, one attack of seizures is there, you usually will not consider medicine. If there are more than one attack, you will consider medicine. So based on uh, child age or based on uh, whether child is a boy or girl and various other factors, baby has other problems like liver or kidney problem, you need to decide uh, what medicine should be given. So you need to select a medicine appropriately based on all these factors, then you should be started medicine. And once if you start medicine, you should be given for two years uh, seizure free, then you will gradually decrease and stop. And if it is due to some other uh, reasons, if baby is not responding, you need to give uh, sometimes you need to give few more uh, medicines also if they not respond for single medicine. There are other options for uh, generalized seizures in children. Are one option is uh, diet, other option is the surgery. These uh, medicines usually rarely require, most of the time they will improve with the uh, medicines.